Listen, I need you to stop whatever you're doing and I need you to drop it right now. All my Sabre stands, I want y'all lined up in the front. It's happening. I could have sworn I got on my bed this morning. Am I sleepwalking? Is this the Twilight Zone? Type Moon has just announced an official video releasing that Sabre has joined the cast of Melty Blood Lumina as a guest character. Huh! Do you realize what they have just done? They have messed with the natural order and added my wife into the game. Y'all boys done fucked up now. It's over. It's over. Her fighting style is coming correct. Her animations look beautiful. She is out here hitting Excaliburs like she belongs in the game. The crazy part about it is nobody knows why she's here. Even her description on her announcement page says shouldn't even be here. They're trolling. They're obviously trolling. Now, I know you guys are mad, and I'm here to tell you, those tears taste delicious. Oh my gosh, she's such a bland character. She's so mediocre. She's the worst hit. I don't want to hear that shit now. We on your ass. But you can say what you want about Saber, but she's about to bring in the bag. This is a money play, boys. To all the people that be hating, keep doing what you're doing. And stuff like this will keep happening. We appreciate you. Anyway, I don't even know why people are frustrated. I was just saying that I was trying to figure out who I'm a main in the game. Because like I said, I main will lock you. He's not in the game. People are complaining that Scion is not in the game. And I'm trying to figure out why. They are the main two components of the entire story for Melty Blood. Without Scion and Wallachia, Melty Blood wouldn't even exist. You think that they're not coming? So I'm not mad that they're not in the game. I'm more so anxious to figure out why they approach the game with this angle. If anything, Nania, Lin, and Alko as well. Not to mention Ryogi. Obviously, they're gonna come down later as DLC, but right now, what's even more important is that they just opened up the gateway, right? Now that Saber's in the game, there's no telling who else they could add. They could add anybody. Emiya, hell, it's already canon that Sael is the one that gave Emiya his shroud when he met up with her. That would make even more sense than Saber. This is a time of celebration, really. You also had Sion, who's been in the last few Undernights, which means we're probably gonna get an Undernight character as a fair trade. So now I'm wondering who that might be. As long as it's not Batista, fuck that character. But yeah, bro, I can't contain my excitement right now. I woke up and saw that on Twitter, but you know, rumors are rumors. I needed to see it myself. If you've been considering whether or not to pick up this game, again, I implore you to at least try it out. There is a reason why people were still playing the old version 10 years later, waiting on this to happen. There's a reason that they kept that alive. It's an amazing game, amazing storyline, great characters, the whole nine. It's looking like that fate fighting game might finally come into fruition. At least we know now that they can do it. And it's not even like she looks out of place. Like I said, she feels like she should be in it. You know, I'm interested to see what else she can do. But as far as the fluidity of her movements, it just feels like yet another Melty Blood character. I ain't gonna lie, man. I don't know what they're doing with Nero's character with the remake. It seems like they're trying to push him to the side. I hope not. But I'm not gonna lie. Y'all can keep that nigga, man. Oh my God, I hate playing against Nero. Oh my God, that character's so cheap. Y'all can keep him. Archetype Earth, y'all can keep her too. You know, I love him to death. Just for the sake of my sanity, just stop it, all right? This is beautiful. Tell me who would you guys like to see in the game? I mean, out of every fake character, I know everybody has their favorites, but who would you like to see? Not just the main cast, not just Stay Night, not just Zero you know, all of Grand Order, who would be the most fitting selections for add-ins? As far as I can see, they're pretty tapped in with the community. Who knows, they might look through one of these videos and actually do it. The whole cast looks great. The stages look great. I will play with literally anybody in this game. There's really nobody that's not worth playing. I even went through a couple of videos and I saw that you can already pick Salter and Nero as one of Saber's costumes. So they did this thinking about the fans in mind. They know what they're doing. So the word is that Kimone, who is the lead programmer over at French Bread, said that he wanted her in the game himself. 
she was among one of the many sample characters that they had when they first started making the game and he said it'd be a shame not to use her so they finished her off and threw her in there so she's not the only one that's supposed to be in there there's a couple of other characters that also got clipped they didn't say who those were but i'm looking forward to them now i need y'all to help me run this video up so we can pay for this game the gods have spoken holy